Hello everyone, Chief Meteorologist James Zaharie here. Glad you can join us. Uh, not quite done with the wet weather yet. We've been noticing a little uh, spotty activity here and there throughout the uh, midday and afternoon hours and still another wave expected to come on through uh, as we head overnight. Here's our future track and you can see the brunt of the moisture by the time we get to just before midnight will be just west of the river. And once that does pass on by, I would say we'll end up with a good quarter, maybe about a half an inch of rain. And then the activity after that will become more scattered. Looks like temperatures will still be warm enough that even around 5 a.m., the moisture will still be more of a light rain. But then as we kind of pour in some colder air down to the surface, we start seeing more of a light mix. And that's going to be with this very light, very spotty in nature as we go throughout the morning with another wave maybe coming in by about mid afternoon and then we should be finally done with all that activity, but it will be a much, much colder, brisk day come tomorrow. Overnight lows will be dropping around 36 degrees come tomorrow. <laughs> Not much of a climb, 39 factor in the wind. It's going to feel a lot colder than that, but at least Friday is looking pretty good. Yeah, good Friday. We'll have some sunshine. Temperatures improving about 48 degrees, lower 50s in as we make our way into Saturday. But we do see some scattered light rain showers that day. Should be ending around sunrise on Easter Sunday morning with a high of 48. And then temperatures starting to rebound a little bit more as we head into early next week.